Hello everyone, this is Sean Fairbairn with Rock Island Armory. Today I'm going to show you the disassembly and reassembly of the M5 pump shotgun. We'll begin by confirming that the firearm is empty. Visually, the nothing in the chamber magazine tube is empty so we can begin the disassembly process. Um, on the disassembly of the M5 shotgun, all you really need is a punch, a small flat bladed screwdriver, and a uh, a nylon tipped hammer. Begin by removing the pin. Okay, sometimes the trigger mechanisms can be a little hard to get out. This one wasn't. Okay, I, we recommend not taking apart this because you can literally with the safety disengage, you can come in here and blow out and brush all the fire controls that you need to, so there's never really any need to disassemble the trigger mechanism. All right, so what you're gonna wanna do is bring the handle back to about halfway. You're gonna pull out the carrier. Okay, this is your carrier. All right, once your carrier's out, you can bring the bolt back forward. This is your lift gate. To remove the lift gate, you're just gonna pinch in on it, remove it from its two detent pins, set it aside, and then now you can get to the, the bolt. Maybe. All right, on the bolt, everything's press fitted in. Uh, you really never even need to get to anything unless you break an extractor or, or the ejector or something like that. And for, for anything like that, we recommend you contact us and get the firearm back and we will repair or replace this firearm because it is a Rock Island Armory model. So it does have a full lifetime warranty. All right, once those are out, you can come in here with a brush and clean out any debris, fouling, unburnt powder, anything like that, you can get out of there, blow it out. You can use like a light CLP and recoat everything in there. You don't need a lot on a pump shotgun. It's better if you run them almost dry. Uh, you don't ever need to take off the magazine tube from the receiver. If you need to, you can get to it from the front. Um, the barrel stays on, it is threaded and pinned into the receiver so the barrel is always on this receiver of the shotgun. So you just basically need to do a simple filled strip and cleaning and this thing should last you a lifetime. And so now we'll begin on reassembling the firearm. Okay, so the bolt goes in and forward. Your lift gate now goes in and down. Bring the bolt back to halfway. There's really only one way for the carrier to go on. Remember the side with the one tab always goes to the back. And it's gonna rest on the two arms that are coming back on the uh, from the charging handle or from the pump action of the shotgun. So once those are on there, you can bring it back forward, reinstall your trigger group. Line up the pinholes. Okay, after reassembly, we're just gonna confirm that the shotgun works and all the safeties features are working properly. Seeing that they are, your shotgun is now ready and this concludes the disassembly and reassembly of the M5 shotgun.